Hello and welcome back to another Xenotic casting demo. We have Uncle Wolfie versus Champ on Warfare. This is a map that Champ has told me he didn't know very well at the time that they played this map. So it is a bit of a weaker map for him. It's also, I believe, the third or fourth game, kind of the middle type sort of games in a best of five. And Champ is going to be starting by just machine gunning up top. Does a good bit of damage to Wolfie, but nothing too big. Wolfie is very competent on this map, though. Taught me how to play it, and I think I'm fairly reasonable at it. Or I was the last time I played. And Wolfie's going to take a more passive style this time round. Holding off at the back. An interesting choice though a minute ago. Just to use that um, blaster up to the top. Rather than standing towards the back. Hitting the button and going up the elevator. First blood with the rocket launcher going to Wolfie though champs down at the bottom does a good amount of damage should be able to take Wolfie out but doesn't quite land the last shot and Wolfie's going to be able to find it much quicker to go up with the blaster up that uh, that section there Wolfie trying to get some control onto this map as of yet he hasn't completely dominated it champs going to grab that but he's going to be out of position. And Wolfie's going to be finding him round the back at the Mega Armor. Grabs the Mega Armor. And a nice bit of movement up there. Again, this is something you only get with map experience. Those little bits of, oh, you can just jump up this. And not have to go round that corner on the stairs. You can jump off the corner. Takes a fair bit of playing around on a map fair bit of experience to be able to understand those bits beautiful air shot there from Wolfie five to nil right now against champ this map it's a small map and pretty much every small map has a especially a small map that's got such an open middle like this has a back and forth style of play so I think we can be seeing some of that in this Champ currently getting absolutely wrecked. Has been a theme in recent times of people sending me demos of Champ getting beaten. They are quite enjoyable to watch. Champ, if you're watching this one, get some demos, send them to me. To be fair, he has been trying to send me some demos, but um, hasn't had auto record on. Which is just brilliant. So have auto record on your demos because then you'll be able to send good games to me and have them commentated. And I promise I won't say anything too mean. Very nice shot there from Wolfie. Champ gets a good couple of shots in as well. Wolfie got that one good shot but I think there was three or four from Champ that hit half as hard. So Champ really doing quite a good bit of damage right there Wolfie with the blaster faking champ out at the bottom of that elevator champ grabs the uh, the health sorry uh, takes a good bit of damage in there Wolfie managed to connect all the shots and take him out 8 to nothing the current scoreline on warfare From the way Champ's playing, you can sort of see that he understands the map, he knows it. But he doesn't quite have that deep, rich understanding that Wolfie does. The small, little nuances of this map. It is a fairly different style of map to a lot of others. There is no Nex, which is one of Champ's best weapons, the Vortex. So that will definitely not be favouring him right now. Wolfie, a master of prediction and rockets. Very favourable to be 
without the necks, without that direct aim style of weapon. So Wolfie, as we hit the halfway mark, is going to be 10-0 in the lead. Champ's still got a chance to pull this one back around though. He hasn't completely lost control of this. He's been hitting some good shots. And keeping Wolfie on his toes for sure. Wolfie not able to back off just yet. And we know Champ's playstyle. If he can get control, he will pick up a lot of frags very quickly. Wolfie, he's fallen a little bit. He's got very low health, just hiding in the corner, trying to stack up. But there's not too many corners to hide in this game. All of them open from two sides or spammable with rockets and grenades if you know where your opponent is and very tight corners so you'll do a lot of damage if you can get a grenade in there Chumps managed to grab a frag back off of Wolfie in a direct head-to-head -head fight like we said and now he's gonna start pulling this back he's gonna start putting some pressure onto Wolfie's score Heavy score lead straight out of the gate, but if he can't hold it to the end, it's not going to make much difference. Wolfie sitting quite low on this, quite low in health. Some good shots. Champ's going to be able to take Wolfie out again. 11 to 3 now. Wolfie. A bit of a dodgy spawn there. Champ able to find him quite quickly. Fairly varied spawns in this. And very few chances of direct spawn fragging. Very nice prediction there from Wolfie. Pulling Champ through, goes through the teleporter and finds Champ on the other side with no stack, unfortunately. So he's going to go down. He's delaying the spawn a little bit, just trying to put Champ off of the centre. Champ flies around the map trying to find where Wolfie is when Wolfie isn't even on the map. So now he's got a little bit of a problem. He's got two and a half minutes left to defend a five frag lead, make that four. And Champ's on an absolute tear. Clearly picked up this map, a few of the nuances, a few of the little positions that Wolfie plays in. And now he's able to make that count on the scoreboard and get some good damage in. Wolfie going to take himself out, go back down 10 to 7 the score now. Champ is clearly pushing hard, he's going to make this... I think he's going to tie this up at the very least right now. Wolfie has to get back in here somehow. He's been unable to quite control it. Just completely avoiding Champ. Trying to go very fast and avoid Champ at this point. If he can get away from him. And set himself up. Then he'll be able to play his playstyle. But Champ knows he's got to force the issue. And force Wolfie into head on head fights. Where Champ is more favourable to take the win. And there we see another one. 10 to 9 now. Champ is pulling this back to a very close game towards the end. He has a good chance at taking this back. A minute and a quarter left. Beautiful shot there though. Wolfie's prediction coming back through as he's able to calm down a little bit more now. I think he's... Panicked a little bit and lost a few frags due to panic. And now we've got him back. We've got the proper Wolfie back. He's got a bit of control. He's not panicking. He's making the right sort of moves. Champ. He's going to be round. Wolfie just trying to dodge the shots. 40 seconds left. Champ's hiding around some of these corners trying to find Wolfie trying to catch him Wolfie is trying to move quite close great shot there two rockets landing he's got 10 health left he's got two frags to go though 
If he can hold Champ off just a little bit, this is completely plussed back. And it looks like it's going to be Wolfie's game right at the end there. Champ did a fantastic job to try and bring it back. But in the end, he was unable to. Wolfie takes it from Champ. 11-9 to 9 on Warfare. Thank you very much for watching. It has been a pleasure to cast this one. Thank you, Wolfie, for sending in the demo. Thank you, Champ, for playing. Please send me your demos. I'm MX Craven on the IRC. If you can't find me on there, ask around and someone will know where to get me. It's been a pleasure. Thank you for watching and I will see you in the next one of these.